Good morning, good morning. Hey, how y'all doing? Uh, it's the bus driver again. Hey. All right, so check this out. I just got through talking with one of uh, the other fellow uh, truck driving students. And uh, he was giving me little pointers. We are uh, about to start getting on the road. We're gonna be shifting today. Um, anyway, let's see. Um, anyway, I just wanna bring y'all up to date to what's going on. Um, Try to get that light up out of y'all. They glare out y'all eyes. Go over here. But anyway, I'm at my hotel. And um, yeah, it might be better. Whew. Okay, so week two, day two. Everything is um, moving along. Um, patient. We got to try to squeeze everything in uh, two weeks so we can go and take our CDL and glare. CDL um, class A test to get our license. Hey, I'm sorry about the glare, y'all. I'm, I'm really sorry about that. Um, I got moved out of my room. Um, I was fortunate enough to be able to have the room that I had here, room 236, for about a week straight. Um, I've been in my new room for about two days now. Uh, they moved me to room 211. Yeah. 211, you know, that's a robbery. And uh, I play a lot of GTA. And my crew on there is called 211 Hustlers, you know. So, I mean, I thought that was ironic that they moved me to a room with the number 211. Uh, anyway. Things are progressing. Um, I'm excited still. Uh, first, I was a little upset because, you know, we were told, those of us who had already um, went ahead and went through the troubles of getting our permit, that we was going to, you know, hit the ground running as soon as we got here, but we had to sit in class for all the book, the book work, and I kind of can see why they wanted us to go through it, because uh, we had to learn about logs, keeping the log book, um, <laughs> out of the stuff like, you know, uh, pre, pre-trip pre inspections, things of that nature. Uh, you know, that stuff there, that's hands-on, you know, but there were some other kind of regulations and things that we needed to learn. So, um, I guess things worked out the way they worked out. I survived, which I'm still here, so. But um, the thing is, I wanted to be able to pull my phone out and record while I'm on the yard operating the truck they have a no no tolerance for cell phones and you know i can see why don't need no mishaps but um, i'm gonna try to get some footage somehow uh, without breaking the rules so that i can actually um oh, by the way see all these trucks that are here all those trucks belong to prime prime incorporated um, I don't know if everybody here is driving for Prime, but um, let's see if I can show y'all this. Right behind me, can't zoom in or out in this mode. Anyway, that place right there. That's across the street from this hotel where I'm at right now. That's actually Prime Incorporated's uh, hotel. And from what I have learned, they get so booked up, they send students over here to my hotel. You know, so I see students all the time leaving, leaving from over here, going across the street over here and uh, 
Yeah. It was real interesting. Really interesting. Just watching. Of course, you know, there's a lot of drama around in here, too. Um, everybody here. Uh, most of the people around here, the inhabitants around here, you know. I don't know, I don't like to talk about people, but a drug scourge is really something, man. Really something. Um, we have a lot of vagrants around here. Uh, you know. <laughs> I don't know. I try to help them out. You know, sometimes, you know, see people with the signs they need some money or whatever, you know, give them like five dollars, you know. I try to hold on to my funds though, because you know, that's not really helping out. Yeah, that's on something else. Uh look at some of the surrounding areas here. That's my hotel, kind of large. That's that hotel I was telling y'all about. They go to that hotel. I think they, I don't know if they own that or what. That's where they, they mostly keep their students at. And back down this way, past that gas station. See, we got all this construction. Got all the construction uh, on the road. It's off of I-44. I'm about eight minutes from uh, C1 truck driving school. That's the school that I'm attending. I think they're doing a pretty good job, you know, learning all the skills I'm gonna need to pass my test. Um, I don't know. Uh, I think next time I, uh, film something, I think it'll be a little bit more exciting. I don't have a lot of information to, to share other than the fact just to tell you that, you know, week two, day two, and uh, progressing, you know, slow and steadily. So I'm getting there. So uh, I'll, I'll see y'all a little bit later. I'll probably post something after I get out of school today. Y'all have a good morning.